everyone, it's Nona Grace, and I'm from Western New York. Today, there's going to be two little videos that I'm adding to this, this video. One will be, you'll see the chickens, you're going to see me checking for eggs, and you'll see the hens that are sitting on, on, their, on the nesting boxes laying the eggs. And you're going to see, because I was watching Grandma Sandy, she wants to know where um, to find your watch hours, how to find it. I did write it down for her, but she said she was is a visual person and it would be easier to find it if I show it. So I'm going to go on to the computer and show that. So first, let's go look at the chickens. I wanted to show you all three holes are full. One, two, three. Oh, and that one's the, one, that one's the nasty one. <laughs> oh my. Yes, that's the one that would sit on Silver Fox's um, eggs. This one's empty. There's nobody in this one. This one's empty, empty, empty. But anyways, yeah. <laughs> Thought you'd enjoy that. See what's in the box now, if there's anything changed. I hear somebody clicking. Oh yes, all right, you're making noise. There's two underneath that one. This one had none left in it. I wonder how many are under you. We'll have to wait to see. We'll see this box again if there's anything. Oh, there's somebody over there. Hello. Maybe she'll lay an egg. Maybe she won't. I don't know. Sometimes they just sit. Gave them all chicken scratch. And we'll check the eggs again. I didn't take the two that were there last time, but I will take them this time. Oh, this she was sitting on three eggs. We're going to take those eggs. And there's three there. Then there was the two that I had on this side. We'll take them. Okay. And we'll check what's over here. There was a hen sitting here. I don't know if she did anything. Oh, yes, yeah, she did one. She did one egg. Okay. So I got all the eggs. All the boxes are empty. And this is where I put them in my pocket. Look at all the eggs. I put them in my pocket. I got two eggs before. And now I got these. And you always put your eggs with the skinny side down. You want the air bubble on top. See, the skinny side goes down. Air bubble on top. And some of them are kind of like, you have to guess. Okay, this side looks a little narrower, so that one's going to go down. But this is what I got today. Two, four, six. I got eight eggs today. These are from the other day. They're the 13th. And then I mark them. Okay. So I almost have a dozen between yesterday and today. Two more tomorrow and I will have a dozen, another dozen to add to my other refrigerator. Now we're going to go to the computer and I'll show you what I want to show you there, how to find your watch hours. Okay, first of all, you're going to go into your YouTube. So I'm going to go into YouTube. And I'm going to sign into my, my channel. Go to your channel. So I'm going to my channel. Are you giving me more lights? Yeah. Maybe? You click on your channel. And there I am. There it says Nona Grace. Woo I'm in there. Okay, now you want to go to YouTube Studio. We're going to go to the YouTube Studio over here. And you're going to click on YouTube Studio. So you click on YouTube Studio and it will bring you to this page. Then you go over to Analytics, which is way over here. 
Sometimes the mouse moves too fast and you can't see things. You click on analytics. Okay, now here's your watch hours. It's, it's right on that. When you hit analytics, you'll see watch hours. And you'll go up to, we're going over here now, to where you're across from the t last 28 days. You'll click on that little triangle and you'll see a bunch of different days to choose from. Well, you want to choose your last 365 days because that's how they calculated. Then you look back to over here and it will tell you how many watch hours you have. As you can see, I have 4,500 now watch hours. Okay, now I also told her that the other important thing is the reach. You want to go to how fast the click through rate is. That's important. You want to know that. So you click on reach and then it brings you back down to the impressions. Now this is for 365 days. Now I want to go for 28 days. So I'm going to go back over to where it was. I'm going to click on 28 days. And so my click through rate is 2.3%, which is, they say anything above two is good. You want to get it closer to four, five, and six. The higher the number here, the better it is for you. So mine has gone up, as you can see. I'm 15% higher, but click rate is important also. And so that's how you find your watch hours. The watch hours is in the overview where you see it. When you first click into analytics, you'll see the overview and the watch hours is there. That's how you do it. Well, that's it. And then I'm going to leave now. Actually, I'll go back to my, my page because I may have comments that I need to answer. So I, when I go to the comments, I go to YouTube Studio and then I go over to comments and I check to see if there's any there. And there is some there. And do you see these little red things? Remember I told you there was the little little icons of people that are subscribed to you. And if they visit you often, they'll have a little heart thing there too. And um, they also are now putting little suggestions for your comments. If you want to use them, you can. I might use part of it, but then I always add to my, my own but um, you can see that they have the little red thing if they've been subscribed. So a lot of times they'll say, I subscribed to you, now it's your turn to subscribe to me. And if you don't see this, I go into their channel anyways because I'm going to watch their channel. Well, I've got a lot of them. Um, I'm going to watch their channel. I would go to their channel, which I'll click on this one. Oh, that's the Grandma Sandy. That's the one that I'm doing this video for. Well, anyways, you go here to the channels, and if their channels are there, you will see them. You go up in their subscriptions. Sometimes they only have a few there, and you could click on here, and it will show you all of their subscriptions. And then I scroll through of those that say that they subscribe to me, and I look for um, my picture. And if I don't find it, well, then they're telling a lie. And you shouldn't do that. But they do sometimes. And so I'm looking for my picture. Do I, will I find it? I should. We'll see. We'll find out. But this is what I do. And this is why sometimes it takes you a lot longer to do your comments because now you're you're also not only listening to a video but you're also checking to see if you find your picture and if you find your icon your picture there then you know they were telling the truth if they don't find it well they're being they're being dishonest but we'll see it said it i was subscribed she was subscribed because I had the little icon. We're going to find out. Come on, where are you? I wish they would put this part alphabetical according to your name. It sure would make it a lot easier. But they don't. And you never know when you're coming to the bottom because it keeps scrolling and scrolling depending on how many people they have. And so you do this. 
And this is how I find, sometimes I can't find somebody's channel and I know that they have commented on somebody else's and I will look in their subscriptions and if they're opened, I can find the channel. Oh, I didn't find me. That's not good. Oh yes, I'm there. So there I am. How did I miss? Oh, there's Liddy. Hello, Liddy. There you are right next to me. Woohoo. I like her. She's really nice. <laughs> She's fun to listen to. And you know, her birthday's coming. Liddy's going to have a birthday. She's going to have it. The 14th of May is her birthday. So be looking for her on the 14th of May to wish her a happy birthday. It's her birthday that day. Okay, that's it for now. We're going to close up and say goodbye. Close tab. Yes, we're done. And we're back to my stones. Arches. <laughs> my what? Arches. Arches, yes. I think this is kind of neat. My other computer had um, a scenery from my own backyard. with, And I actually, when I took the picture, there was a bird in the sky. And I didn't know there was a bird in the sky. So I caught a bird in flight, which was really interesting. Okay, that's it for now. Well, I hope that helps a few of you out there. And I want to congratulate Grandma Sandy for reaching her 1,000 subscribers. She did a video today and she was talking about that and she was thanking everybody that is out in YouTube land and anywhere else that has subscribed to her. And I want to say thank you to all of you that have subscribed to me. I don't know if you've noticed, I'm sure you have. I um, actually got monetized. I finally hit the 4,000 watch hours, but you know, this probably YouTube wouldn't like if I say it, but if you feel like skipping the ads, go right ahead, it's okay, but just watch it long enough to, I told my daughter, just count to five and then you can skip, and it should do me okay, all right, I thank you for that, and I'll see you all again tomorrow, bye-bye.